Good afternoon everyone. This is my modeling tutorial that I'm going to be showing you today. Um, so I'm just going to put on my gloves. And I'm just going to show you a piece of um, the veining. I use I do use ultramarine blue very lightly like I said before and I mix it with the um, odorless thinner. And I have very little in here, and you can see how it goes on. You don't want it to be too thick, but you just want it to be translucent. And I'm going to show you on the leg. I'm just going to put a vein in here at the side. And I'm going to squiggle it on. I don't know if you can see that. And then I'm going to take the edge of a sponge and just go like this with it. So that's how I would do the uh, actual veining on that foot. So I'm going to show you the um, modeling. I'm going to start with the head. Let me put this away. So that's the veining, but just be very careful with the veining. For the modeling, once again, make sure I get all this blue off of here. Some people wash their brushes. I don't, I just make sure I get all the blue off and then all the different colors off. And then I mix it. Now this is mixed, this is my own mixture and I just wanted to get like a bloody cloud color. So as you can see that color there, I don't know if you can see that. That looks like the blood underneath your veins. And I'm going to get a sponge. And there was one I picked. Oh, this one here I picked because it has wider. Um, I have different sponges. Um, just um, wider holes on it. Let me check that out. I'm checking it on my um, paper towel there. And then I'm going to just pounce it on the back. So I put my two layers, like I said on before earlier, of um, flesh coat that I made with the um, 04 and a little bit of red. And now I'm putting the modeling on. So you can see that there. And this is just typically what you do when you go around. You don't do the front of the face right away. You want to do it at the back. Make sure you get everywhere. It's nice and evenly and smoothly. Anywhere I, I can leave it dark if I want. Anywhere that I find might be a little bit too dark, I would take the end of my sponge and I would just go like this lightly and it, the dark parts will just come right off, just blend right in. And that's just what I do. And, for my modeling. After this, I will apply another um, flesh coat again onto it. So I'm going to need some more. But anyway, that's what it looks like. And I have to make sure I get it everywhere. You see there's a piece missing by the air over here. I'm going to have to um, put some more uh, modeling on that, but it has to be everywhere. Anyway, this is a very short tutorial. But that's what the modeling is it is a mixture of your own so i use a little bit of red just a touch of red a touch of blue um i use the blush um that they give you in the strawberry blush the um peach blush i use in here i use a little bit of the purple and the um, burnt umber and i mix up my own combination if i need more i just add a little bit more what color i think i need and it will get me until i get what color I want which is a bloody type of color but I use multiple colors just to get there so anyway I really can't say how much I use of each I keep adding but um, it's for you to get to that blood color on your thing and then you add your old list thinner to make sure it's thin as well you don't want it too pronounced as well and you just continue with that all over the legs and the uh, arms and the um, rest of the body and the face. For the front of the face, you would just do the, um, I do it some on the cheeks and the forehead, but I do that after when I hardly have anything left on the sponge. 
and just lightly do that on the front of the face so there she is the aria kit and i'll give you an update when she's done thank you and you guys all have a good day and remember i have a giveaway going on and please subscribe um to my channel and um you can enter that giveaway on the giveaway entry um video I also want to give a shout out to Tammy Tiny Tots Reborn and to Reborn Mama 2017 as well as A Grandma Loves Reborns. They're all great channels that I watch every day and you guys should take a look and subscribe and like those channels too. They're amazing channels and amazing women. Thank you and have a good day. Bye-bye.